Hi! <laughs> it's a spring, which in Phoenix means that we're getting closer to the dreaded temperatures that are unbearable. But I want to do some spring cleaning because my workspace is a little bit dirty and it's always nice to have a clean workspace. It's less stressful and it's more productive and I got some cleaning montage coming at you. But before I get into it, to celebrate 1 million C-subs, I wanted to do a little C-sub, 1 million C-sub spring sale of my one year doodle challenge book. So if you haven't gotten yours yet, go check out my Etsy shop. There is a big sale going on right now through this weekend. Let's get our, let's get our spring cleaning on. Thank you again guys for all of the nice comments on my previous update video and also uh, it was kind of a weird celebration of 1 million because it hit at a really stressful time in my life. My dad is still being hospitalized and he is in recovery but it's just a long road of recovery. I don't like to read that people are going through miserable times in the comments but at the same time it was really comforting for me to read that it made me feel not so alone in this time in my life where it's you know, taking care of your parents or taking care of your grandparents when health problems happen and it just, it was comforting for me to read your comments and your experiences. And I do wish you all the best and thank you for wishing me um, well wishes and good vibes to my family and uh, yeah, thank you. And I think maybe a lot of people were disappointed that there wasn't a giveaway on that video and maybe they unsubscribed because of that. But who knows, when you get that many subscribers, you are you have to expect a lot of unsubscribers. Numbers are just weird and they go up and down. Anyway, if there's a project that you want to see that kind of celebrates this milestone or just a project you really want to see in general on my channel, leave it in a comment below. And I have a couple of ideas. Red, the other dog in this video that you see is going to be staying with us for a while. He's my dad's dog. And I have been thinking of doing some kind of dog related DIY, like dog picks my DIY. So if you guys think of anything, let me know, or you just might see a strange video pop up with my dogs involved. <laughs> I need to print and cut out this month's uh, limited lemon, March's limited lemon. So what you see here is not available anymore, but uh, it's limited edition. So when the month ends, that's the cutoff. And then April will have a whole new design of stuff. If you're interested, I'll put the link up here and you can sign up for the limited lemon tier on my Patreon. And I am thinking about putting the extras that I have in my Etsy shop, maybe toward the end of the year. Speaking of my Etsy shop, I have been really enjoying putting stuff up there. Even though I've just been doing the doodle book, it's so much easier now. I started Etsy in like 2008 or 2007. It's come a long way. It used to be 
more of a hassle because I was becoming my own sweatshop and that's kind of why I stopped doing it but it is so much easier now and it is more enjoyable. Speaking of, you might have noticed a little uh, shelf, that, that's what YouTube calls it, a shelf below my videos of merch. The fine folks at Teespring provided me a design to start my Teespring shop with Squeeze the Day printed on shirts and there's a tote bag, a phone case, and some other stuff. So if you want to check that out too, that also supports my channel and supports me putting more content out for you guys. You can always find my Teespring shop in my descriptions below. More designs and options will be coming soon. Lately I've been doing this routine at the end of the day where I sit down and doodle and binge watch a British gardening show or a British makeover show. The two I've been watching are Small Spaces Big Dreams, I think it's called, and the Great Interior Design Challenge. They kind of remind me of the two British shows I used to watch when I was a kid. When we first got the BBC channel, I was really obsessed with these two shows, Ground Force and uh, Changing Rooms. It was a long time ago, so some of you might have no idea what those shows are, but uh, let me know, we can reminisce in the comments. I really love those shows. If you like that studio vlog, you can check out more in my studio vlog playlist right here. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the bell, so you don't get... Wait. So you don't miss any of my videos. And all of these links will be in the description below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!